What is up guys, it's Soulbash and we are back again with another pet video. It's been a while since we've gotten to do one of these because they just released some new pets. And the first one that came up was Jib Jab. And I finally got enough stones on him, so we're going to synthesize Jib Jab. And let's take a look at this little guy. We've not seen nothing else behind this bamboo. So he's a beastly little guy. Let's go and check him out. My pets. And where is he at? Is he going to be at the bottom of the list? Probably. Yes, he is. All right, Jib Jab. This is his base stats 4,500 health, 450 damage. Let's take a look at some of his skills. His main attack, he attacks with the sword, dealing 200% damage. Okay, second one is Shield Thump. Strikes the shield forward to knock back the target. Deals 594% damage upon hit. That's pretty nice. Meanwhile, summons an illusion which inherits 100% of damage and health. Sends out poison darts. Poison darts spin at very fast speed. Oh, where'd it go? Spins at very fast speed and sends out tons of poison darts. Dealing 267% damage upon hit and poisons dart. It poisons enemy for 50% of pet's damage every half a second. That is a very, very nice move. Ultimate Defense is the third ability. Jib Jab Shield breaks into four parts and revolves around him, creating a protective zone. Within this zone, allies take 50% less damage, lasts for six seconds. Meanwhile, summons Illusion, which inherits 100% of damage and health and can cast Dark Strike. Dark Strike teleports to the target unit with the lowest health, stuns the target for 2 seconds, and attacks continuously, deals 267% damage upon each hit. That is another nice move on top of it all, and the rare skill is Mojo. Increased damage dealt to player by 10 plus pet evolution times 4%. Wow. When the player takes damage more than 40 Pet evolution times two max health. The damage isn't effective. It lasts for four seconds. Cool down sixty seconds. That's a nice defensive move there. And let's go ahead and start smashing this upgrade button real quick. I of course, went ahead and pre-farmed all of the surge pills that I need at least to get him up to a decent level, so we can unlock all this stuff and let's see exactly what he is capable of doing. And we are up to what level? We're 58. Okay, we are at 59. Everything's unlocked. Let's go ahead and view this. That way we can unlock his spell. And let's go ahead and max this out. <clears throat> All right. Now the current effect increases damage dealt by player plus 10 still times 4 and when the player takes damage more than 40% and it lasts for 8 seconds now it's pretty nice the mana calls went down to 300 instead of 500 alright now actually we need to get some awakenings on him see if we can't get anything good real quick no uh, no toughness no wellness uh sure um no defense why not mega fireproof no we will refine that super piercing sure so getting a few supers maybe already have wellness we already have wellness already have defense Super fireproof, no, we don't want that. Ice proof, no. Mega dodge, yes, we do want that. All right, we are going to continue. We got 27 more, see if we can't get any more good, good ones. Uh, toughness, no. Super piercing, we already have it. Ice proof, no. Toughness, no. We already have wellness, nope. Valor. Mm, I think we're gonna go with Valor over this. 
just because I like that extra damage that it's gonna do. And super ice proof, no. We have 18 more. Super dodge, we already have the better dodge, so we can't take it. Super piercing, we already have. Wellness, we already have. Still have that one. Come on, we have 11 more. No, we need some luck. Super wellness, nice. I'm gonna substitute that. And let's finish Awakening. We have eight more. No. No. <clears throat> Super Sharp Proof. No. No. Super Valor. Nice. Super Aim. Uh, we'll save that. I guess not. Super Wellness again. Okay. And we're going to increase this just because dodge is awesome. And let's go ahead and upgrade the health some. Let's see, get that at least to level 10. And we'll upgrade the damage to at least level 10. Can we? One more? Okay. And you know what? We'll go with some more dodge. And that's it. And let's take a look at Jib Jab now. 86,520 health, 25,396 damage. All right, let's take him for a spin. Let's see, we're going to add him. We're going to replace him with, let's see if he's defensive. Take him along, swap him out with Bork. And let's see how this goes. Now we are going to do, let's see if he's 59, we need something level appropriate for him. Sure, let's fight Triton. Titan. And gonna auto play through it. Straight up to the boss. Now, I don't remember if anything else comes out before him. Nope, so I'm just gonna let the pets have an edit. Let's see how Jib Jab does. He's not taking any damage yet from him. There he goes. Stayed in that poison and just got eight. It's alright. We will finish him off real quick. And I wanted to check that ability out. Uh, let's just auto play, finish this up. All right. And that would have been, can't tell. Okay, we're gonna have to help him out at least. Hmm, seems like he might be a little bit better tuned for PVP possibly. So let's take him in a arena match. And go against a fox mage. And we have a manual. And we're gonna use this ability and see how well it helps and it did the extra damage they started taking was insane guys this is jib jab what do you think about him new pet we only have one more pet to go which is master Shu. we'll get to him when he does come out but guys let me know what you think about jib jab in the comments below Seems like he's going to be a pretty fun addition to maybe the PvP aspects of the game. Uh, but let me know what you think about him. And of course, as always, uh, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.